Ladies and gentlemen of WrestleArch Revolution, it is I, Ryan Pastor, and I come to you today with a very, very simple, very honest, open, and a discussion about an issue that I find lacking severely in our business, and that is that of respect. Uh, recently, my opponent for Final Battle, Mr. Austin Morris, gave his perspective upon respect and how he respects me as an opponent. And since he was so kind to me, how he had so many nice words to say about me, I feel it's only right to talk about three people in WrestleArts Revolution who I respect upon all levels. Now, I'll admit it, it's no secret. I don't like too many people in this industry. I don't like too many people in WrestleArts Revolution. I think there are some people who are simply talentless hacks. I think there are some people who are absolutely horrible human beings. But these three individuals, well, quite frankly, they've earned my respect over the past year and a bit. So I figure it's time to get that out in the open right now. The first person I respect, plain and simple, it's Steven the Midget. And if you want a reason as to why I respect the man so much, then quite frankly, either you haven't been watching WrestleArch Revolution, or you don't know what a true brotherhood is. Okay, Steven the Midget has been with me through all of my life, through all 26 years of my life, and I would never have gotten to the place I am without his friendship, without his support. I love you, man. Uh, Steven was my friend during a time in which many people refused to touch me over this past little while and I thank him greatly for that the second person I respect is a man who quite frankly is one of the only people to get me to admit that I was wrong and that man is Kyle Griffin now it's true I've called him things like a puppet and a stooge for the greater WAR machine but the fact of the matter is, Kyle Griffin is one hell of a wrestler. And any time we get into that ring, Kyle Griffin pushes me to the absolute limit, and I've only ever beaten him once. Now Kyle, as much as I don't like you very much, I sure as hell can respect your ability and your integrity as a human being. And I hope, quite frankly, uh, that you, my former tag team partner, can at least respect me in a similar light. I'm not asking you to like me, because I sure as hell don't like you. But I respect the hell out of you, man. And finally, we get to a man that, quite frankly, all of you want me to talk about, and that is Austin Morris, and he is, quite honestly, one of the greatest in this industry, if not the greatest. Austin... When you and I get into that ring, there is a chemistry, there is an electricity unlike any other. When we get into that ring, whether it be at American Psychos, whether it be at Uprising, there's only few rivalries that can top what we've accomplished. Austin McMahon, Rock Austin, Bret Hart, Shawn Michaels, you know, Hulk Hogan, Andre the Giant, Randy Savage, Ric Flair. When you and I get into that ring, there is an electricity that no one man, woman, or child can possibly deny. But at Final Battle this Sunday, I'm going to do exactly what you asked me to do. Because quite frankly, you're right when you say that it's one to one, we're even, Steven. Many people, including myself and including you, believe that I pinned your ass one, two, three at American Psychos, and I got screwed out of it. Likewise, I can admit, in my home capital of Ottawa, Ontario, Canada, you pinned my ass one, two, three. You beat me, Austin. But as you said, final battle is just that. It implies a finality to one of the greatest rivalries of all time. And I, both on a personal and professional level, could not sit idly by 
and give you any less than my best. Austin, when we link up at the Rogers Center with over 60,000 Ryan Pastor freaks cheering their asses off, we will feel an electricity unlike any other that we've ever been a part of in WrestleArts Revolution. You and I will take each other to the limit that has not been seen in WrestleArts Revolution and likely will never be seen again. Austin, you and I will become immortals on this night. On this one night, Final Battle, 2013. The greatest rivalry to ever grace WrestleArts Revolution gets put to rest. At Final Battle, Austin, we will decide just who is the very best at what they do. And I gotta tell you, I sure as hell am not going to give up that mantle easily. But I wouldn't expect you to do the same. Be ready for a fight, Mr. Morris. Because so long as I live and breathe, you'll get a war unlike any other. You may not believe it, Austin, but it's damn sure true. Because I am Ryan Pastor, and Austin, I'm the very best at what I do. And you know that better than anyone. Good luck at final battle. Trust me when I tell you, you're going to need it.